How do I do fast swing outs? How do I practice when I don't have a partner? How do I do the like scissor kick thing? How do I get better if I'm a follower? How do I get better if I'm a leader? How do I work on my slow dancing? Charleston, Whitney Hop, East Coast Swing, Balboa. How does it work? Tell me! <laughs> I know that feeling, my friend. You are at the right place at the right time. My name is Jamin Jackson and welcome to Street Smart Swing. I don't know if I can say this without people thinking I'm not being sincere, but I believe swing dancing is overrated. It's not easy, but it can be simple enough and easy to explain for people who want to put in the hard work to get good at it. We've stripped away the complexity of swing dancing with our street smart swing approach so that you can have the confidence and the simplicity of technique to mature at your own pace. I encourage you to take some of my taster courses below so you can get a taste of what it's like using our street smart swing technique. We want to liberate you from the feeling of always needing a teacher. Gimme, 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 I need, I need, I need. You might be in this type of condition right now, but not for long. Listen to what others had to say about our content. Hey, hey, it's Shehan from Reunion Island. So about Jamin, I haven't had the pleasure to have a dance uh, class with him um, in person yet, so it's really his writing and the method that really caught my attention. Um, he's very logical in his approach and he surfaces, I think, a lot of key points so that your focus is on what really matters and, and not all the stuff around. And it's not just in dancing, it's in scene building, it's in a whole lot of stuff. He's very... Um, uh, street smart, some would say. Um, he, he, a lot of great energy, um, and he's very approachable. Even, especially when you're stuck in paradise like us, it helps us a lot. Um, he enables you a lot, and um, he's a true ambassador of Lindy Hop. Hello, everybody. My name is Brenton Rebeck, and I've been a member of Street Smart Swing for about two months now. I love Jamin's approach to teaching Lindy Hop because he strips away the confusing stylistic glitter that can distract from the true kernel of what makes Lindy Hop enjoyable for both the lead and the follow. This method has really helped me reevaluate my own fundamentals and develop my own personality as a dancer. Jamin, thanks so much. Hi, my name is Joshua. I learned Lindy Hop about 12 years ago and have been social dancing regularly for the past five and a half years. I recently uh, became acquainted with Jamin um, after seeing him dancing with a friend of mine at an event that we were attending. Um, and he was doing moves that I had never seen anybody do before. Um, so I began to follow him a little bit uh, on social media and uh, was hoping for the opportunity uh, to take a private with him. I recently uh, was able to do that, and uh, I really appreciated getting to hear some of his philosophy of the dance. And instead of just teaching me moves, he worked with me on how I can bring my own creativity to the dance, my own personality to it, and he gave me some, uh, some tips and some tools for incorporating those things uh, into my dancing. If you ever have an opportunity to work with him, I'd highly recommend it. Happy dancing. Jamin Jackson for me is probably one of the best Lindy Hop teachers I've ever had personally. And for me it comes down to uh, three, more or less three succinct reasons. Um, firstly, he's he has probably one of the best attitudes out of any, any teacher I've seen in Lindy Hop. He's really approachable and when he comes in, uh, the classroom really lights up. Um, and it creates this really great atmosphere for learning. Second of all, he gets to the crux of what the dance is, is about for him and what the movement is all about and doesn't waste time with fluff. He really gets to the crux or the philosophical point of what we're trying to accomplish in the classroom. And lastly, I, for me at least, uh, he gave me the tools that I needed to succeed uh, practicing the movements and the dance at home, which is for me uh, where most of the learning occurs in the first place. Hi, my name is Holly Fleming. I'm from Thunder Bay, Ontario. This past year, I helped rejuvenate the Thunder Bay Swing Dance Society after it had died due to a lack of instructor. So as an instructor has only had two years of dancing experience coming into it, I was a little nervous to spend a lot of time working on it. And then when I, when I dragged people out to Midwest Lindy Fest where we met Jamin, and he revolutionized the way that I teach. This past week I got the chance to use his techniques in my class and it has really made the students understand the steps and be able to learn more about swing dance and incorporate their moves and be able to move better on the floor. I can't thank him enough for teaching me how 
to swing dance better and then also being able to pass this knowledge on to my students. Thomas Lady here all the way from Hong Kong. First off, I would like to say that Jamin Jackson played a huge role in my development as a dancer and performer. I dance in a still growing scene where there are no truly amazing dancers to learn from. Once you get to a certain level, the only way you can progress is on your own. For many Asian scenes, we look to visiting international instructors for short weekends in which we can absorb as much as we can, but sometimes that isn't enough. I had reached a plateau in my dancing and Jamin helped me leap over it. Despite being halfway across the world, we had a great chat about how to develop myself into becoming a better dancer and even how to present myself in performance and competition. I think our coaching session lasted less than an hour, but by the end of it, I had a long, long list of ways that I could improve. Um, that's all I have to say, but once again, thanks Shem for the help. I couldn't be happier with my experience taking a private lesson from Jamie Jackson. I felt like he really took time to listen to me and cared about the things that I brought to the table. And as we went through and he talked about the things that I needed to fix, he was always really positive and encouraging about it, but also really clear and really honest about the problems that I had and helped me understand the concepts. He took the time to explain them in a really clear way and kept asking for affirmation that I was understanding things, which I really appreciate. I think Jamin is a great guy and I couldn't have been happier with the experience. Hi, my name is Annie Trudeau and I'm a Canadian dancer and entrepreneur. I've had my dance school here in Montreal, Studio 88 Swing, for 18 years and I traveled the world to teach Lindy Hop. Um, and I can say that Jamin Jackson is one of the most creative dancers that I've met. He has endless ideas, he always creates new moves, he's never satisfied with the status quo. And this is a, one of the amazing things about him and also the reason why I love collaborating with him so much and I hope that there will be more in the future. Uh, I wish him all the best. Hi, this is Julia from Madrid. And this is Pablo. What we like most about Jamin Jackson's classes is that he's very friendly and very creative and that his explanations are very uh, solid and very clear. Yeah, and it takes you to take risks in your social dance so you can improve a lot your dance. And it's fun, fresh and with tons of creativity. It's one of the best teachers that I ever have. Yay! <laughs> I met Jamin at the first swing dance event I ever traveled to. I was very inexperienced at that point, having only been dancing for about a month, but he made sure that his classes were still accessible to me, as well as everyone else in the room. He also found time for me personally at the event, tapping into my excitement for the dance and encouraging me to continue on in the world of swing. Over the years, Jamin has become an inspirational figure to me not only as a teacher, because of the creativity and care he puts into his classes, but also as a community figure for how much effort he puts into creating an environment where people can come to find the same love in the dance that he has. Hi guys, my name is Edgar Martinez, I'm from Mexico City and I'm here to tell you that Jamie has been a huge inspiration for me and for my development in Lindy Hop. Since I first learned from him, my whole panorama of how to dance changed. Now the dance is way clearer for me and my technique has improved a lot. So I'm really, really grateful uh, to him because he has always been really generous with the knowledge shared the two times he has come to Mexico and with all the info in his web in his web page. Cheers and I'll be seeing you soon, Jamin. Jamin Jackson's teaching has been particularly inspirational to me in that he was able to take something as amazing, as complex, as beautiful as Lindy Hop, and break it down in such a way that it could be accessible to people. That's what I like about Jamin Jackson's teaching method. It, it makes Lindy Hop accessible. So, thank you, Jamin. Hey y'all, this is Shelby Johnson from Dallas, Texas, and 2016 Frankie Manning ambassador to Harangue Dance Camp. And just want to tell you guys a little bit about Jamin Jackson. Like, he's been a great help for me because I really enjoy his classes because he has a very encouraging and creative style where he encourages creativity but also gives you 
um, the tools necessary to be able to have the right technique to explore the dance for yourself. He's also a very genuine and down to earth person and really gives you a lot of advice for how to excel in this dance by personal experience and a lot of stories that he gives and is just very willing to take the time out of his um, busy schedule to meet with you one on one and not only um, give you advice on how to get better, but encourage you on the success you, successes that you've had and be able to just um, be there as a friend, as a friend and more than a dance instructor. So if you have an opportunity to take a class from Jamin and work with him, I say do it. Hello, this is Valentina from Swing and Soda, Lindy Hop School in Rome. Uh, last year, we had the pleasure to have uh, Jamin Jackson teaching for us and it was an amazing experience. Um, I learned a lot uh, from his classes as a dancer and as a teacher too. Um, his way of teaching is different from everybody else. He's, uh, he's so clear and easy to understand for a beginner and for an advanced dancer too. And of course his style. He's so full of great ideas and uh, improvisations. We call them Geminations and we love them. We love Jamin Jackson. Bye. Hi, this is Choi from Barcelona and what can I say about Jamin? He's been a great inspiration for me and for my dance since I met him a couple of years ago. And that's mainly because he's not a real teacher that teaches you how to do the steps and uh, corrects you here and there but a person who cares about the community and uh, wishes to transmit his own philosophy and his own values uh, into the music. And that's really something that uh, makes him be uh, unique and, uh, and a great, great, great dancer.